it's a big shock when I had the death of His Excellency Raisi. As I, as I wrote in the book here, we have been dealing with the Iranian leaders ever since we came into government. The, now, when His Excellency visited us recently, I could see that he was a very de dedicated person. But also a unifier. You remember we finished our, our meetings at Entebbe quite late. But he insisted to go at night to visit the projects which Iran had done here in the suburbs. And he went in the, when it was already dark. Then from there, he went to the mosque, the old Kampara mosque. He's a Shia, but he went to the mosque of the Sunnis. And while there, he found our own, because for us we don't believe in sectarianism, the picture he had with our Archbishop, who was also there because of the interreligious council. So this showed, showed two things. First of all, his, his personal dedication. But secondly, his belief in the unity of, of the peoples. And now, that's just locally here, what I saw just in a few hours. But I have been following him, traveling very many places, Venezuela, Pakistan, where, India, uh, Russia, what? Very, 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 very active person. Now, for the people who follow the who don't know much about world events. They don't know the history of, of Iran. Like they don't know the history of many other places. We are, we're now talking of the religious leaders being in leadership of Iran, the Ayatollahs. And then the, some of these Western countries try to say they are Ayatollahs, they are religious, they are this, they are that. But in 1953, there was an elected leader of Iran, Mossadegh, who was not a, a cleric, he was not a priest, he was just a, a reformer, a democrat and who was overthrown by the CIA, led by a character called uh, Kamit Roosevelt. What was the problem of Mossadegh? Mossadegh was wanted to nationalize the oil of, the oil of Iran of, at that time. And that's why he wanted to, had to be removed Therefore, those parasites in the world who live by the miseries of other people should know that their time is over. The third world has come up. The anti-colonial movement in Africa, in Asia, in Latin America, uh, working closely with uh, f democratic forces in Europe will insist on a, a, a fair world, a new order, a new world order based on equality and no exploitation of any person by any other person. So therefore, I just I came here to salute uh, His Excellency Rice's contribution because I could see 
we wouldn't take long, we, we talked a bit, but I could see what sort of person he was. Like I said, dedicated and a uniter, because I saw it here. I, I didn't read about it, I saw it myself. Why is this president going at night to, because you could say that time has passed, uh, let me send the minister to do it. He went himself, he insisted. Then the mosque of Sunni, a Shia. These are some small things, but very, very, they can show you what person he was. So I came to assure the Iranian people that we are with you. With the progressive people of Africa, we know. Uh, we know who is saying what and why. And we are never fooled by any, any, anybody who is playing games. We are glad that, because I think His Excellency Raisi even visited Saudi Arabia. Didn't he visit Saudi Arabia? Yes. This is Saudi Arabia because that difference between the, 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 the Sunnis and Shias, we don't, we don't believe in those ourselves here. Our people here had those differences before, before our time. Catholics, Protestants, Muslims, Christians, with rubbish. Tokay Mambo. We told them off. We don't want. Uh, that's your private matter between you and God, but for the country, you are a citizen. That's what we look at. We don't care about you. you, 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 you. God is the one who knows who, who, is, who, is, who is good and who is bad. For us, we are dealing with the matters here on earth. And here on earth, we are talking of market, we are talking of, of, of roads, we are talking of, of, of schools, health. Then God does his own things also. So we, we, we rejected that. That's why when His Excellency Rice went to old Kampala, he found all the church people there. The Muslims, the Christians, they were all there to receive him. And that picture you should should put it out on the social media, the one where he was with the, with the Mufiti and with the Archbishop. It's very, very important, very important legacy for for His Excellency Rice. May his soul rest in eternal peace. <laughs>